Right, hello, I'm here with Alex uh, after our 1 1 draw at Boreham Wood today. So, uh, yeah, encouraging performance there, Alex. Yeah, I think attacking wise, it's the best we've played all season. Um, especially in the first half, there were three or four moments of, of play where, you know, Blair, Blair was dropping in, he was getting involved in the build up, and that led to quite a few chances. And I think, um, although the result is a draw, I think we're probably the worst, worst off of that result. I think we should have gone on to win that. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it, it, you know, we said it on the um, on the preview show. Is you know, Bournemouth definitely came to win the game, didn't they? So that, that obviously made a difference. For, uh, Mason could set up in that sort of formation where they could catch him on the break. I think we did that well in the first half, and you know. But for the, the post, that, uh, that shot from Blair after they'd scored. Um, yeah, it, you know, there was plenty of positives there and they were looking to get the ball down and play it out as well, wasn't they? Um, yeah. yeah, and I think especially, you know, I mean, obviously a great goal from Oweka, but, you know, we can, we can maybe talk about John Benton's goal being ruled out. Um, I mean, I think it was given for handball in the end. It's a bit of a late call by the ref. How did you see it any better? I didn't. No, I didn't know at all. I mean, um, it was a good, good. Again, it came from a good bit of play there, didn't it? You know, yeah. Charlie Stephen got that ball in, which he was doing all afternoon, getting those crosses in. And uncustomary, uh, I don't think uh, Nathan Ashmore in the, the Bournemouth goal looked as secure as what we know him, no, known him yeah. to be. You know, there was a couple of times there he was not quite getting to balls and. Even with some of the shots that we had in that first half, they were getting deflections and just literally going straight into his hand. But he wasn't collecting them first time, yeah. which we know he can do. Well, I think that's, that's the, the Bournemouth of back line in general today. I, I don't think... There were times during the game where they did look a bit shaky and they looked a bit on edge, especially towards the end there, where you know the game was very open. And I think, as I said, I think we, we could have gone on to win that. Yeah, definitely. I think you know, when, when the six added minutes went up there, you know, you, you get sometimes when you get that like, six eighty minutes, you sort of think, oh god, it's going to be a long six minutes, don't you? But you thought, yeah, we've got six minutes to actually go and get a get a goal, and we had a few chances to put the ball in the box, and you know, it just wouldn't drop for us today. But it's definitely uh, shoots of recovery there. It was, it was definitely a performance of you know we deserved the draw, and like you say, we could have gone on to get the win. So absolutely, yeah. Again, you know, two good sides having a go at each other, and hopefully we can you know build on that momentum and go on Tuesday night and, and get something at Chelmsford. Yeah, and I think, you know, last, towards, especially towards the end of last season, when I was watching games especially, I, I always felt we had a privilege that we would win. I had that expectation. Mm. I think this is the first game this season where I felt that today. I thought we were probably the better team throughout. And in my head, was once we equalised, I thought, OK, that win's going to come. And, you know, as I said, it, it didn't quite fall for us today, but... It is definitely signs of improvement, signs that the players are gelling. We, as I said, we saw some great passion of play today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, on to Chelmsford and hopefully on, onwards and upwards from here. Yeah, let's hope so. So uh, Stones are in action again on Tuesday evening and we will uh, be resuming our normal customary Stones Live commentary on that game. So join Fred and Joe for that. Um, so until then, come, come on, on you Stones! stones.